Hey, what is up, y'all? Back at it with another video. Today we're gonna head over to Floresville, Texas. I gotta pick up some some interior pieces for my for my C10. I uh. Damn it. I uh. I was gonna buy them on you online, but I got a hell of a deal from this guy that's stripping down a C10. So we're gonna head out there and go pick them up. Y'all stay tuned. Pull a couple of interior pieces out. Just really need the headliner. I'm gonna get that redone. And all these plastics to go around it. And then a couple on the door. And that's pretty much it.
shit is so depressing. This is usually filled up on a Saturday. Look at this shit. What the hell, man? All right, guys. We're here at the the poster shop. Buddy's a little worried about, you know, still running business while all this shit's going on. But when I was able to drop everything off, he said hopefully by Wednesday he'll have everything wrapped up. I'll get to install next week. But good on pricing. This is his uh, shit. This is his card right here. Y'all ever need anything? Just hit him up. Real cool, dude. All right, guys, we're gonna be in the, in the truck today. I'm gonna go drop off some lawnmowers at my dad, and I'm gonna go drop off my my row pan to get painted. <clears throat> All this shit in my damn pocket. Ugh. y'all back on when I get back to the shop. Guys, we out here. We're at Graham's. All right, y'all, there's a rope end. It's in the plastic still. Brought it over here to my buddy to get it sprayed real quick. What do you thought, my front? Come to the gate, on the end of the street. Hurl it.
rotors arrived for the for the Camaro. So when we get those fuckers painted, uh, painted the row pan already. I mean, it came out good. <clears throat> I need to let it dry, then cut it and buff it. I'll do that sometime during the week. I'm in, I'm in no rush for that. But I mean, it came out good. For what I paid, shit. Break practically nothing for it. <laughs> it only took them about an hour, but yeah, I'll get it installed sometime this week. All right, guys, this is part of the shipment that I was waiting on for the C10. I keep get, getting delayed because of all this coronavirus stuff, so just wanted to give y'all a quick update. This is what's going inside. That's why I'm getting all my interior fixed because. I don't know if I ever showed y'all. Maybe I'll show y'all in the next video. But my C10, the inside, pretty much has no interior. Like, it just has a seat. And the dash, the door panels, everything that I bought. But I bought it pretty much bare. So that's why I've been looking for, you know, all the pieces for the inside. But I got, uh, what are these? These are the five and a quarter with the one inch tweeter. These are going to go for my kick panels. Where are they at? Oh, here they are. I got a little prefab. I didn't want to mess with making them or anything, so these are just easy to install. A little five and a five and a quarter with a one inch tweeter. And I got two sets of six and a half. Same thing, Fosgate. Two sets of them. Uh, I'm going to build speaker pods, so that's why I got two sets of them. Should sound decent. I mean, I'm going to have six speakers for my mids and highs, so I mean, that's a, and a little single cap. That should sound good. Got me a little epicenter. Gravity made by carry-on, so it won't sound too distorted. My amps, I'm having an issue with them. I'm not too sure what route I'm going to go with them, but I mean, we'll see. This is going to be for my, my, uh, my lows. It's 500 by one, same thing, false gate. I got two 10 inch crossfires that I picked up from Vincent. So this, this should push them decent. I had this same app in my uh, little single cab, the step side, and I pretty much had almost the same setup that I bought here. And it sounded good, I mean, it sounded decent. I liked it. Now for my mids and highs, I got a 300 by four, but they were out of the, see, cause I bought it. I bought two amps that looked exactly like this. This is the 2019 model. This is the 2020. And what happened was they ran out of the, you know, the ones that look like this. So they just went and they sent me this one, but I, mean, I don't know. I don't know how much of a big difference it's going to make. If I show my amps, like if I build me a nice little setup in the rear, then I want both of my amps to look alike. So I haven't got to that step yet, but if I don't show them, I put them under the seat or something, then it's not really going to matter. Nobody's going to see them. I'm going to go with the, I'm not going to go with the radio, double dead and all that stupid shit. I'm going to, I'm going to just go all Bluetooth, put me a little Bluetooth player in there and feed everything off from there. But yeah, I went it with Fosgate guys. I'm not a, I don't chase the what's big in here and all these other crap that all these stock watches are using right now. I'm old school. Fosgate has always worked for me. That's what I'm going to stick with. But yeah, guys, whenever I get the rest of the shit in, I'll make another video and just let y'all keep y'all posted. I can't get a exact ETA because my damn shipping day keeps changing. But yeah, I'll let y'all know.